The Adventures of Wooly the Sheep. Wooly the Sheep loved polka music. While all of the other sheep loved singing, Ba Ba Black Sheep, Have You Any Wool? Wooly liked polka. Wooly liked polka music so much that he simply couldn't get enough of it. The problem was that the other sheep didn't like polka music at all. In fact, Wooly listened to polka music so much that he really annoyed all of the other sheep. One day, after getting very irritated by Wooly's polka music, they pulled their money together and bought Wooly a set of headphones. Now he could listen to his beloved polka music without bothering all of the other sheep. Wooly loved it. He wore his headphones everywhere he went listening to polka music. But the best part was that none of the other sheep had to hear a single note of Wooly's annoying polka. Everybody was happy. Everyone but Wooly Shepherd, that is. You see, when Wooly had his headphones on, which was pretty much always, he couldn't hear the voice of the shepherd. And because of that, Wooly would often miss important instructions that usually led him into trouble. There was the time that Wooly almost fell off the cliff because he was too busy eating grass and listening to his music and didn't hear the shepherd's voice when he screamed, Wooly, look out! No one will ever forget when the shepherd told all of the sheep to walk carefully through the meadow, but once again, Wooly was listening to his headphones and didn't hear the shepherd. As a result, he stepped in every cow patty on his way back to the fold. Wooly had to sleep in the corner that night, and all of the other sheep had to sleep with clothespins on their noses. And who can forget the time that Wooly had to tangle with Mrs. Dither's cat? The shepherd told the sheep to stay away from his litter box, but Wooly stepped right in it because he had those crazy headphones on and didn't hear a word. It took more than a few stitches to stop the bleeding that night. So you see, kids, not listening to the shepherd got Wooly into trouble all the time. His love for polka music and his inability to listen caused him problems over and over again. If we're not careful, we can be just like Wooly. We may not be listening to polka music, but we let the noise of this world drown out the voice of the Good Shepherd. When he speaks, we often can't hear because we're too busy listening to many other voices. When that happens, we're sure to find trouble just like Wooly did. I'd like to tell you that Wooly has learned his lesson, but sadly that's not the case. Come back tomorrow night and we'll see what Wooly has gotten himself into this time.